Hello. Hello. Today I would like to talk about one of my favorite movies, The Secret. Perhaps you have already watched it. This is one of those films that teach viewers how to improve themselves, how to achieve a success, how to get what they want. Not everything that is said in this film is immediately clear and self-explanatory. Therefore, many viewers review this film to better understand the ideas that are presented in it. I also watched this movie several times. Why is this film important to me? Many years ago, I received a message, a revelation that changed my life. Since that time, I am trying to pass the knowledge I received to people. Once, when I was speaking to a new acquaintance and I described to her what was given to me, she asked if I watched The Secret. I said no. She offered to bring me a disc with the film to watch. I watched the movie and noticed the similarities of ideas in the film with those that I tell to people about my knowledge and with what I told to my new acquaintance. The Secret is based on the book with the same title written by Rhonda Byrne. The main idea of this film is that the wishes of a person would be fulfilled if they were correctly conveyed to some kind of a phenomenon which they call universe. The principle of obtaining or achieving of the desired is called the law of attraction. It is considered that you attract the things you, that you think about or that you dream about. This principle includes three key elements. First, if you want to get something or achieve something, you must ask about this very thing clearly and definitely. Second, what is required is that you sincerely believe that you have already received what was desired. The third element demands that you are morally and physically ready for the moment when it is being presented to you. This system is very interesting and I can state that it is functional. My life experience convinced, convinced me of this. However, I found it to be weird that they called the source from which you receive your gift a universe. Usually people believe that God is a power that you can ask for good things and the good and the God gives. Nonetheless, in the movie, the source is called universe. I see it as an advantage that the word God is not used in the film to describe this phenomenon. I believe so because most people are used to think that to get something from God, you should deserve it. This is mainly according to norms and rules which religions impose on followers. If the word God has been used in this film, some of the viewers could doubt who this teaching refers to and not so religious people could reject the whole approach entirely. Some people could also have a low self-esteem and doubt the effectiveness of this principle personally for them. The word universe in this case allows most people to avoid applying their personal understanding of God to what this film is about. Why did my new acquaintance find similarities in the, in the ideas of the secret with my teaching? It is because I teach practically the same, with the difference that I am directing my audience not to the vague concept of universe, but to a more personified, although a little bit scary phenomenon we call spirit. The difference between my explanation of how to achieve success and their explanation is that I reveal a very important detail, which will not only simplify the acceptance and, and application of the system, but will also help to find answers to more serious questions. Why is this phenomenon so important for me? The thing is that many years ago I got a message that there exists a union of many souls that can share information with each other. Both spirits can also influence other minds. The easy access to the knowledge of all of the souls involved in this union 
The ability to influence other minds tells me that we are not helped by a traditional god, which many imagine to be a person, and not by the universe, that vast space filled with planets, stars and galaxies, and which is hard to imagine as a mindful entity. We are guided to success first by our consciousness and some consciousness, and secondly, we are helped by the union of many souls that can share information with each other and with us. I'll, I call the interaction of many souls God for simplicity. When we talk to God, we are practically talking to a group of souls, each of whom have the ability to transfer information and instruction into into our subconsciousness and the subconsciousness of the people who participate in our success. Why is this film important in my life? I often try to explain my knowledge and how it may be useful for people that I meet. It's not always easy and the environment of meeting friends or acquaintances is not suitable for long continuous conversations most of the time. I just find it convenient to offer them to watch this movie, The Secret, for the beginning, then it is much easier to explain that it is not an abstract universe that directs us toward our dreams, but the souls that love and care about us.